I'm here with Eurisa at the Narwhal booth. Eurisa, tell us a little bit about Narwhal. Okay, so this one, the Black Machine, is our 2026 flagship, and we call this Narwhal Flow 2. As you can see, as usual, our uh, product is always in white color, but this year we changed our color and the shape into like a more sharp shape and in black color because many of our audience and customer they just ask me that, do you have like a more uh, black or a tough guys kind of like a product? <laughs> and we just designed this one, and we actually like got the light bar on the side of this and uh, if you turn on this it can change your colors well, while you're doing your dry uh, dry dry the mopping or do the self-cleaning system so you will change the color and the second of all did you see this we got the VLM what is VLM this is actually our visual language model which can let your robot vacuum see everything what are, are we talking about everything is because like when you go through the pad it can actually recognize pads like a shoes and the tables you won't just give you a category you won't give you the specific item kind of like so sofa like a table or a carpet or your pets so we got a special three different kind of a carry mode the first one is pet mode which means when you're out of your home you can use our robot vac vacuum to phone call to take a video call with your pet like a come on buddy buddy come on so when uh, it's walking around in your home, it saw a poop or a pee pee, it can just like uh, get over. You won't just like, uh, wah, you won't just like do that. But will it, can it, can it clean up pee from a pet? Pee? No, because we were really worried about it. You know, cat pee really uh, smells so bad. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So we won't like uh, to clean that pee. And also poops, we won't clean poops. It just like uh, do the obstacle yeah, that, avoidance. That, that's a good thing. <laughs> yeah. And the second of all is we also got the baby care system, which is what, what are we talking about baby care? If you got a baby, if you have a little baby, the most important thing is don't wake them up when they fall asleep, right? So if we're running, if the robot vacuum is running while the baby is falling asleep, he will just turn low the uh, speed and the voice, trying to not wake the baby up. So this is the second part of that. And the third part of that is once the robot vacuum recognize your phone, your rings, your Apple Watch, and uh, someday somehow if you're missing your phone or watch in your home, it can actually can help you to recognize it, to find your watch. Watch. You can So if the battery's dead on your watch, it knows where it saw it last. Yeah, if you yeah. lost your battery, you can actually find them. That's cool, right? Oh yeah. So basically it's all of that. And this is our new cordless vacuum and uh, we got a specific section over there. If you want to have a look at that, we have a, a specific uh, a team member. He can actually introduce you to that. Okay, definitely. Now I do got a question here. I see there's two things here. Mm -hmm. I'm assuming like clean water, dirty water. Is that yeah. how that works? So you can see we got two machines here so the smaller one actually you got the self drainage system which means you don't have to pull in the clean water and pull out the dirty water but in this one I think the majority of people they are choose this one because their house don't have the self drainage system which is the outer drainage system so they are choose this one and we um, we are set up like around around the 1499 in this kind of a price range this machine is running outside over there if you want to look at this it's actually running under the oh, underneath yeah underneath it's run, running underneath yes and you can see actually because it recognizes it's a baby bed so it comes so slow and so quiet because obvious they don't want to wake their babies right yeah they can recognize there is something over there as you can see, this is our regular run mop. When it goes through this, it can actually spread all over the floor. And this is our track mop. Our track mop are going kind of like a tank. So tank, you know, yeah, tank tires rotate inside. Rotate inside. On the inside and yes, of course. Out. So I can show you. And what is that? Just coffee? Just coffee. Yeah, coffee. And this one is the regular round mop, and this is our track mop. Okay. You can see, just get started.
you can see, this is a regular it's a huge mob. difference, yeah. Yeah, this is our track mob. So are you talking about your, you got some gap into your floor or something? Yeah. I think we're actually quite confident with that, the circumstances. And so which which units use this type of technology? Is this like the previous generation no, this, and this one's the newer? Uh, yeah, this is the most of previous generation. And after that, we use this. You can go through this way. After the round the circumstances, we actually change our mob shape into the triangle one. And uh, if you got the toe kick or the under the board, you need to uh, clean the corners or something, you can just like do this. Yeah. You just twist it out and to do the mop extension and it's just That's like cool. a spin to clean the yeah. corners like this place or this yeah yeah place I see I see that yeah and because and it's a triangle one does does the base unit clean these too yes of course so after you do your job he do your job so he will come back to the base station and the, the base station will clean up all of the mop pads and the inside okay. the water tank so if you see this it's actually also can do the mob extension. Oh, like that is so cool, like, yeah. Yeah, that was so cool. So we go go upstairs, like do the mob extension and clean them up. Now I see and, there's two buttons for each. So what's the tangle free design here? Yeah, here. Do you see that? This is the ah, side I see. of so brush. It, it folds yeah, this, itself up. Yeah, this is the roller brush. So we got this. And you can see actually we got the uh, the side brush is doing an extension. So it won't be tangled in the side brush and the roller brush. I mean the hair yeah. or the pet hair. This is our flow too. And this is uh, this sample I suppose is our inaugural Frio Z10. Yes. So for my floors, they have like the deep grooves. Mm -hmm. What is the best solution for that? I think the, this one should be better. To be really honest, because we also got, uh, consider your circumstances, because we got a 12 downward pressure, you know, so it cleans like a human being's hand. You won't just like a da da, it just like a. Yeah. Yeah, it will cleans like that. So 12 downward pressure to help you clean your sofa or like, a, sorry, carpet or a hard floor really thoroughly. So are these two the latest and greatest that Narwhal is offering right now? Of course, this one. This is our latest product, and we call this Narwhal Flow Two, and we are released this uh, this product in uh, around April, I think. And this is gonna be our 2026 flagship. Okay, so it's available for purchase now and both of them this is uh per, you can uh, available right now but this i think is after april after april gotcha okay yeah. all right and then uh is this replaceable like how how long does this last what kind of warranty is there on this is there a need to have a spare one of these three years warranty three, three, three years, years warranty? warranty okay and uh how long should we change for the mop hat uh, i'm sure there is a reminder in the application we can remind you what's the time you need to change it. Okay, and yeah. maybe does, about does three or with, four months. Does it come with more than one? Yes, in the box there are three. Okay. So we got one and three more. Kind of like that. Yeah. One and three more. Oh, sorry. Uh, total in uh, three parts in total. Okay. So three total. Gotcha. And then, do you buy replacement packs of three, or how does that work? Uh, I'm not sure. We haven't decided yet. Actually, it's available okay. in, in because, April. Because yeah. um, because we need to launch this product in April. So actually, we're finalizing our project, and uh, because in the CS, many people will give us some feedbacks. So yes. we'll yeah. uh, uh, collect the feedbacks in our product team, and if they got more like a feedbacks or decision, uh, I'll let us know. Gotcha. Yeah. Okay, excellent. Cool. All right, well, thank you very much. Yeah, thank you. Thank you.